Hey guys, Brito here. Welcome back to our Formula 1 2017 Motorsport Manager Series here with Red Bull Racing. Here we are for episode number four. We're going to head to the Black Sea Grand Prix from Russia. So a quick recap on round three. Dubai Grand Prix from United Arab Emirates. Ricardo came home P2. Verstappen came home in first. So another 1-2 for Red Bull. That's our second 1-2 for the season. So we're doing fairly well. Drivers' Championship were doing well. Ricardo first, Verstappen second. Teams were on top. So that is great news. So let's quickly check our mail. Um, bug mission update, not too bad. Don't want an interview. He's got neck issues. He's got a dodgy neck there. Verstappen, unfortunately, minus 10 fitness, which isn't too bad. Fitness isn't that big an issue. Um, okay, so the car repair is getting done. We've got 10 days to Black Sea Grand Prix, so it's going to be tight. Okay, so Sergio Perez is hated by his own mechanics. Well, that's not very nice of his mechanics, is it? Um, let's have a look. What have we got going on at the moment? Um, we've got one more engine coming, don't we? We really need the reliability to be pumped up on this one. But, um, so six days before the race, that might be okay. Anyway, let's continue on. Six days after the race, I should say. So, introduction to the GMA. Going to be a vote coming up soon. 40% chance of rain, which is good. Um, got the best design center around, so we know that's good. Johan Monet is scouted. Gilani. Gilano, Alessi, or Alessi, yeah, not, um, not very good, not overly exciting, not even good as a reserve driver for us to be honest, but um, anyway, continue on, get the results from the GP3, round 2 of 8, so Nico Kari took the win, Kevin Jorg second, Marvin Kirchhofer, Kirchhofer, Third. Right, continue on. Uh, still continue. Not much else going on. We're going to do our design. Engine design is going to be finished. Um, Scout report is also done on Pasta Maldonado. He's shocking. Should be better than that. He's old anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um, don't care about interviews, mate, to be honest. Don't care. So, engine design is finished. So it's 950 to 1,023, so we're going to put that on, gonna clear that, put that and that. Um, doesn't really matter, we'll have to look at it after the race anyway, but that'll do. So we've got 80% engine, so we're going to go fit parts, so that engine we can use. Ricardo or Verstappen? That's the question. We're going to have to give it to Ricardo because he's our number one driver. Uh, yeah, 900, 900, yep, yeah, that's good. It's not that parts were built, so I've only got 4 million, million left. Um, there's nothing we can really do except for the wind tunnel. Is there anything we've got to be able to improve any more parts? So, so everything else is fairly good, like our brakes and our gearbox. So you could possibly do some brakes because they're fairly cheap, only half a mil, so we'll do some brakes, why not? Plus 20 to acceleration, continue, that'll do. Scouting, we can clear that, we don't, it doesn't really matter. Um, Robert Kibitz is next. Nico Kari, Randy. Um, I think we've scared everybody that ain't in a team, haven't we? I think so, yeah. Can we? I don't know what we have to choose either or both. Can't we just do any? Um, doesn't matter. We need them to be in the single seater anyway because no point in um, scouting somebody that's going to drive a GT because we don't race GTs. Okay, so we're traveling to the Black Sea Grand Prix today. 
Okay. Warning, you have an injured driver. You can leave an injured driver at home to recover. Drivers are still who stay at home heal faster over race weekends. We can swap Verstappen out with Sebastian Buemi. Don't know if it's really worth it, to be honest. Hmm. Let's look at our drivers. How, how bad is Buemi, to be honest? Compare him with Verstappen. Can't even see the difference. He's not very good at all. Um, we're gonna we'll we'll bring him in. We'll leave him in the race. That's fine. Sponsor select. We're gonna go with first because we should do well. Hopefully, we're gonna go. Uh, say four mediums and the rest softs. So we shouldn't need a hard tire. Part fitting's all good. Right, yeah, do what I usually do, guys. I'll go in, get practice done and dusted. We'll come back when ready to hit qualifying. Here, round four, the Black Sea Grand Prix for Russia. Right, yeah, guys, welcome back. So, practice is done and dusted. We're both going to go with level three quality trim and soft tyres. Car setup is two purples and a green each. So, exactly the same. Um, if you have not seen my Motorsport Manager with mod series, you wouldn't have seen the weight stripping yet. Um, I'm not sure exactly how it works, but I don't think we want to completely strip everything out, do we? Like, I'm not exactly sure if we do that, if um, we can change it once we go back to the race. That's something I'll need to look at sort of off camera. So uh, we'll reset both of those. Suspension, I think we'll get away with 80%. So let's drop down two of those. Front wing, we can drop down one each. Gearbox will leave. Rear wing will leave. Brakes will drop down one each. So we'll gain a little bit of percentage. We lost 20%. We gained 60 points each. That'll do, I think. We will take qualifying, of course, so it's just the one quality session, I think, if I remember correctly, which I usually can't, but anyway, we'll send Ricardo out first on a set of used mediums. Just see how he goes, see what sort of time he posts. Might send um, Stappen out around about now with a set of used mediums as well. Go and have a look at um, Ricardo. Both guys going to have a pretty clear track, so that's good. Hopefully, Ricardo's going to have a clear track. He's coming around now. There's going to be a few guys coming out of the pits. No, he should have a pretty clear track. That's good. We're starting his flying lap now. Stappen's perfect and good. We didn't even see Ricardo's, but that doesn't matter too much. Ricardo's three tenths down the first sector. What about Verstappen? Four tenths down to leave five tenths down, eight tenths second sector. But we are on medium, so you know it's probably not going to be great. So second down on Vettel, which is fine. Just need to keep a close eye. I know there's going to be a bit of wet weather this weekend, but hopefully not enough to affect us too much. So we're going to bring Ricardo in, obviously, to finish his lap, set him straight back out on a set of softs. We've got heaps of softs, so. Can pump out another lap here, hopefully. Do the same with Verstappen once he gets in his box. Set him straight back out on a new set of softs. Go back and look at um, Ricardo again. Hopefully, we both have decent clean track. See how Ricardo goes. Perfect and perfect. Well done. He's coming around to start his flying lap now. Let's see how he goes first sector. The snap in here is going to be good and overheated. Oh well. well he's a tenth down. Really two tenths down first sector actually. Second sector is half a second. Wow. And the snap is three tenths down first sector. Wasn't good enough. 
Uh, 120.9. So he did okay. He's going to do better than Verstappen. Verstappen's done a 21.4. So he's yeah second behind. Can't complain. We'll be able to get him back out for another lap, I think. We should be able to. So let me straight back out. We've got four sets of soft, so that should be enough for the race. See if he can improve again this time. I don't know if he'll have enough to take pole, but we'll see what happens. So I don't know if there's a way to check um, how much other cars have stripped weight off. Like, obviously we haven't. We have. We stripped um, four clicks, I think it was. So these other guys could have stripped off a lot more weight than we have, so I guess we'll just have to wait and see. It's as good as the track's going to get now. Stappen's going to come across the line with, what, 20 seconds to go, so he's going to get a last lap in as well. Cardo's two tenths down the first sector, so he hasn't improved, so we'll bring him in. We won't waste those tyres. Got Verstappen, he's up. First sector. About second sector, he's up again. But I don't think he's going to improve his position. He has up to sixth spot, well done. So fifth and sixth, can't complain with that. But Bottas from Hamilton, Vettel, Raikkonen, Ricardo, Verstappen, Perez, Ocon, Alonso and Massa. Top ten. So it's not too bad. Let's take Quali for Quali two. Looks like there might be a little bit of rain actually. To send them both straight out again. Um, I think. Let's go for a used set of softs. Off you go. I'll send you out just after a used set of softs as well. Because it's supposed to. Well, there's a chance it's going to rain this session, so. We need to get them out as soon as we can, just in case. There might be some rain that does actually come through. There's three tenths down first sector, so it's not doing overly well. Second sector, well he's going to be up of course, but he's all half a second down. Okay, 21 flat, what about Verstappen, 21.3, so not the best. Is it going to be any wet weather? Can't see any just yet. Still got Hamilton and Bottas to post times. Hamilton goes into second. Bottas is probably going to take the lead, I think. Yes, he does. So we're still eighth and sixth. So that should be okay for us to um, hold on to those spots, I'm hoping. Don't think there's going to be any rain. I know we can improve on that time, but it's a matter of tyres, really. We're going to have to start on these tyres, which unfortunately aren't the best. We said about to have a look. So they've got 9 to 11, 11 to 13, 9 to 11. So they've been a little bit used and abused. I think we're going to have to go again. So we're just going to have to wait and see. Okay, so Verstappen's on the bubble. Thinking he's going to have to do one more lap. Put him on a fresh set of softs. We're just going to have to use them. Ricardo should be okay. There's no water at the moment. No, no water this session. Like well, there might have been, but there's not, so... It's 
come around across the line. Oh, everything's overheated, wow. And yeah, he's dropped to 11th. Hopefully this new set of tyres is going to help him gain that half a tenth he needs. He's green the first sector, which is good. If he greens every sector, he should make it back inside the top 10. Second sector he's greened as well. Hopefully he's done well in the second. And he's a 21-1 or 21-2. 21-1, well done. So he's up into 8th. So 7th and 8th now. So everyone's finished. That's it. So 7th and 8th. Gonna make it through. Just waiting for um, Stroll to come into the pits. There we go. Pole position. Well, not really, but Bottas has finished Q1 and Q2 on top. So I have to come back for Q3 now. Just quickly skip through this. Take qualifying. Now there's some wet weather. Damn, it's going to be Inters. So he has to start with those, doesn't he? I thought so. Inters. Can go straight away. You can go out now on Inters. Just in case we um, don't get any dry racing later on or dry quality later on. Send them straight out and see what they can do. Let's never take specialists. He's got a dodgy neck, we know. Uh, quality trimming soft. He hasn't got any. Neither of them have got any wet weather characteristics that are going to help. They are overheated and extremely overheated. Good and perfect there for Verstappen, so. Hopefully he's going to do an okay lap. So it might dry a little bit, so we'll just set a time here on these tyres and then. We'll have to wait and see when we can go out on a set of softs. So 121.5 and a 122 flat. That's 1-2 at the moment. No one else has purpled any sectors at the moment, so looking good for Red Bull at the moment. Of course, it's going to get dry. Hopefully, it doesn't get too dry. Hopefully, it gets wet again. But it looks like the track grip's going to pick up slowly. So we're going to have to go out and post another lap, I think. A set of softs. Just have to wait for the perfect time. So Ricardo's on top of the moment. Verstappen's in third, but just a matter of waiting for this wet weather to disappear a little bit and get a bit more track grip, and we'll send him back here. Five minutes to go. Give you out the first one out on a set of softs. I think we're just gonna have to go out now. Just in case it rains again. Stappen, you can go out. Um I don't want to use because there's I don't know how many laps the race is. Let's just use that set. Off you go. You can use that set as well. Why not? Actually. You'll have three, yeah, we'll use a fresh set for Giardo. Let's see how he goes. See if we can post a decent time now. So good and overheated, and overheated and perfect for one. And the other, so neither of them had a really good, really good start to the lap there with their tyres and brakes. So Verstappen and Ricardo both purpled first sectors, of course, but because we're the first ones out on um, softs, Ricardo's not up by much considering it's dry. So one, two at the moment for Red Bull, the 20, 20 point six and a twenty one flat. Oh, here comes some more rain, so that might help us a lot. That is nearly perfect timing. Hopefully Hamilton won't improve second sector. He has. He's purple the second one as well. He might just pip us. Where is he? No, Vettel's there. So is Hamilton. 
No one else should beat us, so third and fourth. The rain didn't come in quite quick enough. That's a good result, guys. That is very good. I'm glad I actually went out there and I didn't wait too much longer because the wet weather is here. That's where we're going to start, though. Third and fourth. Hamilton's on pole. Vettel seconds. Ricardo, Verstappen, Massa, Raikkonen, Ocon, Bottas, Kvyat, and Perez. So, obviously, Bottas is the one that didn't gain anything there from that, considering he finished first and second on um, Q1 and Q2, so he's lost out a lot there. So, continue on. The race looks dry. Is it dry? No. Inters, inters for both. Good. Um, we're going to go medium tyres and race trim. I don't think it's going to get overly wet. Can't really see. Um, what are we going to do? Race trim and tyre changes. Why not? Um, car set up. Both good. Can't change our fuel, can we? We can. Why would you want to? Because we can't refuel, can we? I don't think we can. I can't remember. Anyway. Um, driver strategy. Attack and overtake. Attack and overtake. Click the right button. Start race. So we should have checked out weight stripping then, shouldn't we? Anyway, it doesn't matter. We're starting third and fourth for the Black Sea Grand Prix from Russia. Five red lights and we're green. Ricardo's had a pretty good start down the inside there of Vettel. It's going to move straight up into second spot. Verstappen's dropping. Wow. Ricardo's ran off turn one. Damn. Dropped him all the way back to 20th. Pushing too hard into turn one. Verstappen's in seventh though, so he's our saving grace. But he got 2% ARS too for some reason. Thought we should have had a bit more than that, but doesn't matter, I suppose. So Verstappen still in seventh. Ricardo slowly making his way through. He's up to 18th now. Verstappen's going down the inside here of Kvyat. Can he hold him into the last corner? Going to go around to Ocon as well on the outside. He has. Well done. Up to fifth. Um, we're going to... We'll just triple speed it straight away. Doesn't matter too much. We'll zoom out a little bit. So Ricardo's 15th now. Verstappen's fifth. Ricardo's up to 14th. Let's have a look. So it might dry quick here. We're just going to have to wait and see, I suppose. We're going to have to use a bit of our um, hybrid mode soon. So we are pushing fairly hard, but we want to. Oops, didn't mean to click on that at all. Go back to neutral. Zoom back in a little bit. Neutral with both. Hybrid mode with both. Try and get those fuel numbers down a little bit. Here's Bottas, up in the 5th spot, just behind Verstappen. Ricardo's up to 11th, so he's doing really well. We might have to bring him in early to um, try and undercut all these guys that are on Inters. If we can plan it right, that'll be perfect. Let's go back to push and push. It's definitely going to get heavier now. Go back to medium and medium. Breaking and needs to get out of your way. Yep, here comes Bottas as well. So he's back down to fifth. Ricardo's up into tenth now. Stappen's got uh, Ocon just behind. So they're all running similar strategy at the moment. Not pushing too hard. 45 laps to go now. Water on track. It's going to disappear fairly soon. Maybe end of lap 12. How long have we got in these? Another seven to nine laps. What about the stap and six to eight laps? Okay, so we have to be fairly careful here with our tyres. Might have to come back in for another set of inters and then pop out for another set of softs, I'm thinking. Let's um, push and push as well. We're the only two that are pushing, but we're doing pretty good. Because Bottas is what's through the middle of uh, Vettel and Raikkonen in there, up into second. So Verstappen still fifth, Ricardo's up into eighth. 
Gardo's doing really well considering he went off on the first corner. Stappen got blocked there a little bit by Raikkonen. There goes Ocon. Here comes Hamilton as well to make a move on Verstappen. Hamilton's down the inside and off he goes. Everyone's still sort of running neutral neutral so we're going to drop back to neutral neutral now. Try and conserve a little bit of fuel so we can use a bit later on if we need to. Still sort of just waiting to see how we go with these tyres. Gonna need to pit for another set of inters or come in for softs. I'm not really sure. Because Verstappen's down to 30% already, but it's not dry enough for softs yet. Verstappen is chewing through these tyres. 41 to go. Still a fair bit of wet weather. Track grip's not going to pick up for a little while. These tyres are wearing down, we do know that. There goes the wet weather now, slowly starting, to, slowly starting to disappear. Let's um, go push and push with both. I know they've got bad tyre wear, but we're just going to have to leave them out. Maybe go overtaken hybrid. Um, overtaken hybrid try and work through this tyre wear a little bit better. It's not worth coming in just yet. But I don't know if it's worth coming in next lap for a set of softs. How many laps left? 39 laps. We have to go for two sets of mediums anyway, aren't we? 17, 34 laps, so... I mean, let's just go attack and attack. Come in, get another set of inters on. Um, Cardo's going to have to come in next lap now. Yeah, because he's... Might have to do the same. not come in on softs too early. So you can still attack and overtake for a little while. Go back to hybrid mode. So Ricardo's going to be in this lap, but he's slowing down big time. Everyone else is probably going to come out on um, softs, I think. Yeah, masses on mediums. Ricardo's going to come back out on inters again. Just going to run them hard again because I think it's going to be hopefully going to be a bit better for us. Ocon's on hards, Kivyas on hards, Palmer, Sainz, Grosjean, Verline. I don't know how well this is going to go for us, but just going to run us flat out hard for as long as we can and then come in for a set of softs. Let's have a look at the snap and did a 26 2 last lap. 28 8. sure how well it's going to go. There's still plenty of water on the track, so... 26.7 last lap. 25.5 for Ricardo. Go back to neutral. How about maybe next lap we can come in. We can come in next lap as well. Or maybe... No, nah, they might be able to come in next lap each, but... Come in this lap, let's just attack, overtake. Come in for a set of softs. 17 laps, there's 34 to go. Um, no, a lap after. You can attack as well, attack as well. Might as well, let's keep them going flat out. Next lap, we're coming in for snapping. Don't you stress. Set of softs. Recharge and balance stop. Okay. 
come in the next lap. But Ricardo keep him using his hybrid mode. He comes out, he's gonna attack and push. He's gonna be in this lap for a set of softs. Park conditions good, recharge none, strategy balanced. Still using his hybrid mode, so 3.6 seconds. Great stop there for Verstappen's crew. Ricardo did a 27.7 last lap, Hamilton did a 26.9. So maybe one lap too late for Ricardo, but. So come out and go high and push when he comes out. It's going to come out in ninth spot for Ricardo. So maybe one too many laps, but. Leave him, leave him on push for a little while, let him warm up a little bit more in size. We're going to have to we'll save our hybrid mode for now. So Verstappen's right on the back of Vettel. Mass is just ahead as well. Can he make a move soon? Go back to neutral with his tyres. because they're starting to hit that little red mark there, the hot mark. I don't know how well that strategy paid off for us, but I think we hope for us a little bit more rain later on. A 25-3 for Ricardo, 27-6 for Verstappen, which is pretty slow. Just had a bad sector somewhere. Let's have a look. Bottas did a 25-6, a 26-3, and a 25-6 for Ricardo. So Ricardo's got the same speed as Bottas. But Verstappen's lagging a little bit. Park condition's still pretty good. There's Vettel and Massa just ahead. But Verstappen, Verstappen's going around the outside. Couldn't make it stick. Let's go. Attack and push hybrid mode that hasn't helped him either so 7th and ninth at the moment I think Ricardo should be able to catch Ocon pretty quick because of the tyres he's on but come on Verstappen we need to get through here around the outside that's it well done you got Vettel just ahead as well Go, attack and push. Come on, Verstappen, you need to get through pretty quick. Let's go. Boost down the front straight, go back to neutral. And high. There we go, down the inside, mate. Well done. Hold it, hold it. Back down the inside for the next corner. Well done. Up into fifth. Ricardo still in ninth now, trying to make a move here on Ocon. It's down the inside, well done. He's going to go back to neutral, high, and recharge mode. Both doing fairly well, so 5th and 8th at the moment. Stappen's just behind Massa. 25-9 last lap and a 25-7 for Ricardo. What about Bottas? 26-3, so pretty quick lap times here from Red Bull at the moment. 23 laps to go now. Any more wet weather around? No, nothing at the moment. Here comes Ricardo up to the back of Vettel and Perez. Both using boost. We've got a little more than what they do. One Ricardo down the inside into one. No, not quite close enough. Gonna have to go hybrid and push and attack as well. Overtake. 21 laps to go. So we really need to keep a close eye on Stappen here with his tyres. There's Van Dorn getting lapped as well. So Verstappen's fifth, Ricardo's still eighth. Still, tyres are still a bit of an issue. 
Ricardo's trying to. You got ahead of Perez, and he's going to head of Vettel as well. Vettel's got really bad tyres compared to us. Watas and Raikkonen are both just pitted again. So still fifth at the moment for Verstappen. Ricardo's now up in the sixth spot. Tyres are fairly warm. We'll be in very soon. It's overtaken hybrid. We need to go back to neutral. So 19 laps to go. I don't know because they're not going to be enough. We might have to come up with a set of mediums. Um, we'll go for a small recharge and hope for the best, I suppose. How far behind? 2.2 seconds. Going to attack. When he comes out, you can high and overtake. High and push, I should say. Ricardo's in this lap, so you can overtake mode. You're coming for a set of mediums. Gonna have to no charge for him. Eight seconds on the tyres. Wow, it's gonna kill us. Just happens back in ninth. We've got more charge now, but it's not gonna bloody help us, is it? We'll just use it all, try and gain some time here. Ricardo's in the pits, it's going to come out in his new set of mediums, and there's another mistake with tyres. 10 seconds for Ricardo, god damn it. Oh. Two stops in a row, guys. Two stops in a bloody row. Just not good enough at all. So, still ninth and 8th. Ricardo's pushing very hard. Let's have Verstappen push hard for a lap. Set him hybrid, you can hybrid as well. Fastest sector, first sector, which is good. Fastest second sector. Go back to neutral and high. Same with Verstappen, neutral and high. So 8th and ninth at the moment. Hamilton's going to have to pit again, but he's he's in the pits now, but he's way out in front of us, so it's not going to help us at all. Come out in a set of softs. So it's still going to be 8th and ninth. Verstappen's slowly catching up to Massa. We didn't catch him last lap, but he had a bit of a slow lap anyway. He's even slower this lap, Verstappen. So there's 13 laps to go now. There's 4th, 5th, 6th and 7th all just in front of a snap and they're all really close to each other. So let the snap and sort of catch back up with his um, tyre heat and we'll get him to push again soon. This race isn't going according to plan, like we would be up potentially. We'll be 4th and 5th at the moment with the snap and Ricardo if it wasn't for those bloody issues in the stop. Perez is in, so that's one spot there for Verstappen and Ricardo. both now 7th and 8th. Ocon just ahead is having issues with his car as well. There goes Verstappen down the inside, well done. Can he hold it? He has. So 5th spot, Massa is just up the road as well from Verstappen. Ricardo's got a big gap back to Perez. Going to boost um, Verstappen next lap. Hybrid and um, full out attack next lap. There we go. Do the same with Ricardo. Do it for as long as we can. Verstappen's green that first sector. How about second sector? Greened it as well. What about Ricardo? He's white the first one, white the second. All of us happen. Up into sixth and seventh. Mass is just ahead of Verstappen now. Gonna have to put them both to neutral at the end of this lap.
both back to neutral because the tyres are starting to get a little bit hot. Still both pushing fairly hard, but Ricardo's still got heaps of fuel left in the tank, so we can push for a little bit longer. Verstappen will just drop back to high once that's finished. So Alonso's just behind Verstappen as well, so we don't need him causing any bloody dramas here, which he's gonna. They're still 6th and 7th. We're doing okay at the moment. We would like some more spots, but as I said, it just the race hasn't played out well. The strategy wasn't good to start with with the rain. The issue with both drivers and the tyres wasn't good either, so it hasn't helped us a lot. Still going to get points, which is good, but we're not going to get as many as I'd like. But we can't win them all, as we know. Five laps to go now. Let's um, overtake both guys now. Boost for Stappen down through there. Boost Ricardo out of there, why not? Just issue with his engine. Yep, we know. We're not doing too bad. So we catching Massa at all? 24.8 to a 25.2, so not really. Let's go to push with both guys now. 24-1 to a 25-2 and a 25-1 for Ricardo, so we're not catching Massa at all. Portas has got some pretty average looking tyres up there and so does Raikkonen, so we can keep our tyre where a bit better than theirs. We might be able to catch them towards the end. He's going to have to go medium with his fuel. We're going to have to go high with uh, Ricardo because Verstappen's right on the bubble with fuel numbers. Boost Verstappen out of there. Boost Ricardo in and out of this corner. There comes Ricardo on Verstappen. Back to neutral. Back to neutral for both. It's only a couple of laps to go now. This is a final lap. Let's. Attack and overtake and hybrid. Attack and overtake, and you can go hybrid as well. I don't think we're going to get anybody else, but um, unless any, somebody runs out of fuel. So, Massa's tyres are pretty shot. So is Vettel, so is Hamilton, so is Bottas, but they've crossed the line already. Raikkonen's taken the win. Bottas second, Hamilton third. Vettel's going to be fourth. Massa's going to be fifth. Verstappen's sixth, and Ricardo seventh. So, not the best race, guys, but not too bad either, I suppose. Would have been a lot worse. I said, we lost 10 seconds, so we should have at least been, well, 5th and 6th. Could have been. But, um, that wouldn't have made much difference, would it? Only an extra couple of points each, but... I think that's where we've gone wrong. Just didn't extend our tie life enough. We should have went to like a long stint on mediums and a stint on softs at the end like Hamilton did, but anyway, can't change it now. It is what it is. So eight points and six points. Not sure we had the fastest lap of the race. Don't get bonus points for it anyway, but so Daniel Ricardo is still on top, tied with Kimi Raikkonen. Verstappen's dropped back to third. We're just in front now by 27 points over AMG Patronus and Ferrari is not too far behind as well. That's going to be a pretty big battle there for top three in Constructors. Let's wait and see how these guys improved, of course. It's taking its sweet time. <clears throat> Definitely taking its sweet time. There we go. The morale's dropped a little bit for 
Ricardo, but it's not too bad. Little improvements here and there. Mechanics aren't overly happy. Expected third, we finished third, so that's good. No improvement for Chairman Happiness, of course, and the marketability didn't go up, unfortunately. An extra half a million in our back pocket, because we didn't finish first. We know how all the results have gone, so... We'll just continue to do what we're doing, I think. We've got um, another set of brakes coming in. Where we can't really work, see what we're improving our parts with, but um, we've got two decent engines there. That'll be 998 and 992. Hmm, I wonder why. I also chose something different, but once they're good, they'll be good for us to go. We're going to improve our brakes as well. So, anyway, guys, if you enjoyed that episode, hit the like button, leave a comment, let me know what you think we did wrong. Was it the tyres that killed us, the 10 seconds for each driver or whatever it was, or was it my strategy, or a combination of both? You know, let me know what you guys would have done. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so to continue to follow our Motorsport Manager Formula 1 2017 series. This has been Bredos Gaming. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again soon when we come back for the Tondola GP in 10 days' time.